So, hey, everybody, welcome back to my channel. I know we are in crunch time. We're in the last few days before Father's Day. Um, I do plan to go out Friday. So, y'all, as you can see, I'm trying to whip out multiple inexpensive gifts. So, as you can see, my table looks a little bit, a lot of bit chaotic because of that. Um, so, I am um, basically... I'm working on, as you can see, multiple, multiple gifts. I'm just doing, um, I set my boxes up <clears throat> side by side. <clears throat> Excuse me, you guys. So sorry about that. Um, I set my boxes up side by side. These are the boxes that you get from the Dollar Tree that are nestled, in, nestled inside each other. And um, I just started from the smallest to the next, to the next, to the next, lined them up and um fill them with different items um you know basically based on the size of the box so um i had three different kinds of boxes that i got from the dollar tree i had this brown one that looks like a suitcase i had the next uh level up that is like a toolbox and then i had that blue one and all of these i got last year um you guys from dollar tree so, um, I basically just lined them up. I did have, um, several of these. Um, so some of them, I think the red one, I ended up using a few of those twice. So as you can see, I've got several gifts going on. So I'm going to just show you some of the stuff that I, um, that I'm doing. <clears throat> um, I'm also doing these bags over here. Um, y'all forgive me. I got, look, I got my. I got everything going on over here. So I do have these two bags that I did. These are the little, um, um, what do you call it? Um, co not, they're not cosmetic bags. Um, me, I don't know the bags that the men take when they're, uh, doing showers and stuff. So, um, I had, I found two of these in my stockpile. Um, you know, these came from Dollar General, a blue dot. I got, I didn't get these this year. I didn't even go out to look for them this year. These were some that I had in my stockpile from last year. I only found two. So I used these, um, to, um, for some inexpensive gifts. So basically in these, I just put an accent in both of them. As you can see, I put the dad, um, picture frame in that one. This is a deck of cards that I got from Dirt Cheap. I put some X um, soap to go with the gift set, and then I put the loofah, and that's going to end that set. In this one, I put the X set again, a green loofah to match the bag. Um, these are a pair of socks. I think I may put a picture frame in it as well, and then um, the soap, and then that's going to complete that. I did buy, I just went to the Dollar Tree today and bought... Um, a few more of the picture frames because I thought that turned out so cute and that would be just an easy, um, you know, way to have an inexpensive gift with some of these boxes that I have. So I did go and buy, I think, three more of those. So um, that's some of the accents that I'm, I'm doing. I'm going to go back here to the back, you guys, if I can kind of get around some of this chaos um, so I can show you guys some of the stuff that I'm doing. Like I said, I've got um, a little bit of everything on this table because I'm working on multiple gifts at one time. And as I get them completed, as you can see, I'm wrapping them up, putting my Father's Day balloons on them and moving on to the next thing. And these Father's Day balloons, you guys, I got these from um, Bargain Balloons. I got them probably last year, two years ago, I think. And I realized I only got just this kind um, so I'm probably gonna have to place another order to bargain balloons. The only thing I don't like about these is these are not self seal balloons. You have to have a sealer, which I do have. Um, and sometimes, uh, with using a sealer, sometimes you can burn your balloon, but I've gotten a little bit better about using my sealer. So I, I, um, but these are the only ones that I have. I don't know why I didn't get a different kind, but anyway, so all of my, balloons um these are the 10 inch balloons are gonna have that i do have some of the bigger ones for some bigger gifts but anyway i just wanted to show you these so anyway these are the x sets that i have i haven't put any shred or anything in it i have the x um gift set in there with the body wash one of the um 
blue and brown uh, mugs. Y'all, I just love those mugs. Those mugs just look so high-end to me. And then um, in this one, I have another one of the gift sets. I have a pair of socks and I have a towel. I am going to put a bar of soap in there in front of that towel to complete that set. Those socks are, I think, the um, gamer socks. Um, so that's going to complete that. And I'll turn this box. Let me turn this box around so you guys can see what the box looks like. This is the box um, that they had last year that was in blue. And so that's that one. So then in this one right here, I have another one of the X gift sets. And I use the blue ones because the box is blue. So to match the box, that's what I did. So I had some of this Barbasol aftershave lotion and aftershave and shave cream, excuse me. I had that in a mug, you guys, or a, um, I think I either had it in a mug or in one of the little buckets. Um, and it didn't sell last year, so I took it out and added it to this, and I think it worked out perfectly. It turned out to be a very, very nice gift. So that's that one there. And the small one here, I just put the um, accent, the soap, and I think I'm going to change that. I put the little work light, but I think I'm going to put something else in its spot. Um, I don't think I'm going to use that. So anyway, I wanted to show you those. Those are my blue ones. And here are my red ones. So let me scoop this so you can see the red, uh, the red containers. As you can see, some of them I've already wrapped up. And what I've been doing is as I'm okay with what's in the container, I'll go ahead and just wrap it up, put my balloon and everything and so that's kind of what i've been doing so with the small one right here again i have another one of my x gift sets um the black uh soap that goes with the gift set and one of the hand wipes and that's all that's in that one this one right here has multiple things in it you guys so i put the um put a bottle of cologne in there that's the box that box is empty to go with that cologne those are some socks that i had uh, they are the socks that have the cards on them. I showed you that in a previous uh, video. Those are some of the uh, a deck of cards that I got from Dirt Cheap um, with that little nice blue and uh, red design on it. It matched that box perfectly. And um, these, this is a, another bracelet that goes with that. I thought that was really, really cute. Just a really cute little set, um, kind of like a poker themed um, basket. Um, here again is another one. Here's some more of these wipes that I told you guys that I have a lot of. I'm going to go ahead and pull some more of those out of my uh, box because I have a ton of those um, that I need to go ahead and get used up anyway. And so in the back of that, I have some uh, razors. I have my shave cream and then I have some um, Old Spice um, soap in that one. That one is just kind of, I don't know it's it's okay um it's ran, kind of random and i'm gonna price them as um they're gonna these all of these gifts are gonna be anywhere from 20 um probably 25 to 30 dollars um uh this one may be 20 because i i just don't um see you know much in this one right here this one um for sure will probably be closer to 30 dollars um, but like I said, somewhere between $20 and $30, that's what these boxes are going to be. <clears throat> this one right here is the body wash and the body lotion set that we got from Dollar General um, on clearance. I think after Valentine's Day, I got a few of those, either Dollar General or Pop Shield. Maybe Pop Shield. I can't remember which. One of them. Anyway, the Stetson Cologne, same thing. It came from... A dollar general after Valentine's Day, and um, that one was not on uh, clearance. But my the manager at the store that I went to wanted to get those Stetson out of her stockpile, so she went ahead and marked it down to ninety percent and gave it to me at ninety percent off. So I put some more of those. I put a pair of those football socks in there, and that ended up being a cute little uh, set there. Final this one right here. I'm still working on this one. I can't I haven't decided what all I want to put in this one. This is one of the uh shaving kits right here that came from Pop Shell. I bought this nice uh razor or shaver. Um it came from um Timu 
and I'm still trying to flesh this one out. I'm st I haven't decided what else I want to put in there. It needs something else. I may change the um the mug out um and then do some more. I don't know. I gotta. I'm still trying to flesh that one out, so I haven't figured that one out yet. So I'm working on that one. Okay, next up is my brown sets. Y'all, this one is, um, I've used some of these games that I got from um, Dollar General. That is one of the speedball games that came from Dollar General. I had, I've had i had those games and stuff um, since last year. Like I said, I again, I did not go out and get uh, none of the clearance stuff because I have a whole box from last year. So I put one of the um, mugs in here, the football socks some of the white another uh set of the wipes that i got from uh that i had bought from dollar tree last year and i think i'm gonna change this right here i'm gonna change that to the dove cream but just because of the gray and everything that's going on in that i want to change change that cream and then that one would be done this next one up right here is another one of the sets uh it's exactly the same as this one i just did it in the different box and i did a different pair of socks in this one, I did the, um, the, uh, what do you call it? The, like, uh, worker or the, um, it has the, um, wrenches and stuff on it. Uh, uh, hardware or handyman, handyman, I guess is what you would call it. Handyman socks. Anyway, the next one is this game right here, four piece puzzle set. Um, it, this one has the mug best dad ever with the football socks the aftershave lotion um from from uh dollar tree again this these two things were um in a set and i pulled them out of the cup and added it to this uh box to make a new uh set here right here this is another one these two things right here were in a cup it didn't sell it may have actually been in that cup i'm not sure but anyway i added that to this set and then I put some of the little Jolly Rancher socks in there. I'm not sure if I'm going to leave those or if I'm going to change those. I might change it to the football socks. I don't know. I have to think about it. But anyway, um, I put that in there. And then that's the, I, that I completed that set. This one right here, I think I'm going to take apart because I think I want to make this a little more high end. Um, because of the wallet and the sunglasses, I think I'm going to put it in a bigger concept. And make it um more money because I can really I can uh boost the cost or the um boost my profit on the wallet and the sunglasses if I put it in a different concept. But this is the way I have it right now, but I think I'm gonna change it. And I have some of the royal honey in here. Um so I haven't decided I but I'm thinking I may pull that out of there and put it in a different concept and make it more high end. This is one of the um, buckets. I'm going to do uh, a few of those, a few of these, maybe like two or three of these little buckets. And it just, it's just basically a work light. It has one of the little uh, box cutters uh, in there. And then I, I went back and bought some more of the handyman socks. And I'm going to put, I'm going to take this, I'm going to open it up since it's, it's just a cello bag. Um, I'm going to open it up and put some of the little handyman socks and I'm that you know make that a little complete uh little bucket set. Um I have two of the little um box cutters so I'm going to do um two of these. And what I did was I have some of these stickers y'all. I put this sticker on the outside of the bucket so that if I decide that I don't want to um if it doesn't sell for Father's Day, I can just take that sticker off the bag and um put it out for another holiday. Um, so anyway, you guys, that's what I have going on so far. Oh, let me show you this last thing. I forgot about this one. This one right here is, I found some of these boxes, y'all. I don't even know. I don't even remember buying these boxes. But anyway, um, I found some of these boxes in my little box. Uh, I have a thing that I have all my little bags and boxes in. And I found this and I thought this was really cute. So I, um, it's, a real easy way to uh, package one thing. So what I did was, these are some of the flasks that I have, some of the Jack Daniel flasks. So I put this in there and I put the little funnel, if you can see that over there in the corner, I put the little Jack Daniel or the funnel, the flask funnel that I bought to go with these. 
and I put that in there um, and I'm going to add a bow here and that'll be um, the, the, you know, that completed little concept. I thought that was a cute little um, gift um, that I could just add for, you know, just one item really inexpensive, but um, it, you know, may be a value. Um, so you guys, so y'all tell me what you think. Like I said, these are some of the completed ones, except, you know, of course I got to go back and put my bows on. I haven't put any of the bows on them, but this is, you know, what they're going to look like with the Father's Day balloons. Like I said, I've already started trying to complete some of them. I have blown up more balloons. So that's what I'm working on today. You guys, I did go back to, um, dollar, um, tree. And I found a few more items. So I may do one more video of inexpensive things. And this, and I'm just doing these. I know this is very, very last minute. Um, but this is just, uh, I'm doing these just to maybe give y'all some ideas. Because when I'm trying to think of inexpensive stuff, y'all, I'm trying, I, you know, sometimes it's harder to think of the inexpensive items than it is to think of the more, ex in, you know, expensive concepts. So that's the reason why I'm showing this to you guys. It may not be useful to you now, but it may be useful to you for another holiday um, where you can think of some inexpensive ways to make Father's Day gifts. And it also helps me as well. So I ended up going back to the Dollar Tree and I did find some, um, y'all gonna make some of the little buckets that have some of the, um, hair stuff. Y'all men that like to do their hair. I found some wave, um, wave caps with the, uh, uh wave brush and some, um, hair oil. So I'm gonna put that in a bucket. That'll be, um, a little, um, you know, inexpensive, uh, bucket that I can do. I'm gonna, I bought two of those. So I'll do two of those buckets. Um, I, and I, y'all, I realized I have in my stockpile, let me show you what I have. And I forgot all about them. And I don't know why I'm sleeping on this, y'all. Um, but let me show you, hold on. And I'm not getting on the camera, y'all, because I'm just not, um, y'all, you know, I'm working in crunch time, so I'm not presentable to myself to be able to try to get on camera. Um, so that's the reason why I'm not on camera. But I'm trying to show y'all these balloons. Y'all look, look what I found. I found these balloons that I bought from Bargain Balloons again about two years ago in my stockpile. And y'all know I have those Saints Cups. I'm going to blow these up and I'm going to make some little Saints Cups for Father's Day. Those are going to be so cute. I totally forgot that I had those in my in my um that I had those balloons until I started working on these concepts, you guys. And then I came across them. Um, and I was like, Oh my goodness. So I got one more thing that I'm going to show you, um, that I did. And I thought this turned out really, really cute. You guys, um, hold on. Let me clear, um, a spot so that I can show them to you. Hold on just a second. Hey, you guys. So here are the last two things that I have completed. I'm, I, I'm debating on whether I'm going to do any more of these right here. Y'all, of course, y'all know there's no room on my table, so I've set it down on my floor so I can show them to you. Um, And so these are some of the slippers that we got from Family Dollar. You guys, I did just decided to do like a little slipper concept. And I'm going to get close so you can see it has the Axe Soap, the Axe Deodorant. I use one of these um a dollar um per or uh, colognes from roses and y'all these are some of the cute socks that dollar tree has again over here is the same slippers you guys um with the uh axe deodorant i don't think i put soap in this one I, I need to go back and put some soap in that one um and then it has the cologne and the uh socks y'all tell me what you think i think they turned out really really cute I want to go buy back and get me some more of these Cheetos and Dorito socks. Y'all have a ton of the different um, socks that they came out with, the, the different cute socks from the Dollar Tree. And I think I'm going to do uh, some of these for Christmas. So, you know, you y'all know I'm about to go back to Family Dollar and try to get these slippers. I did not get many of these slippers because I was like $3 and I could probably get this for a better price. But... Y'all, but y'all, this little concept right here, this will make it worth it for me to go and get these from um, Family Dollar. 
y'all tell me what you think and these i put these in my little 14 by 16 shrink bags i couldn't find i wanted to use some 12 um uh 12 inch shrink bags or 12 inch cello bags and i did not have any in my stockpile so i just decided to use uh my 14 um inch shrink bags 14 by 18 not 14 by 16 14 by 18 shrink bags that's what i'm using um for these uh concepts most everything on the table that i did y'all is um i'm using my 14 by 18 shrink bags for most of these boxes that's what it fits is the 14 by 18 shrink bags and you don't have much room at all you basically just have to tape it down to the bottom and you're done so anyway you guys i just wanted to show you guys what all i had going on today as you can see i, I um i'm trying to do multiple um inexpensive gifts because you guys know that's what um one of the things that people are looking for so i'm trying to make sure i have a variety of inexpensive gifts and i'm doing it like an assembly line because like like i well like you guys know we're down to the last couple days and i'm trying to get as many done as i can so that i'm not having to work so hard um friday night and saturday night trying to meet demand so thank you guys so much for watching i hope this video was helpful maybe gave you some ideas of some stuff you might can do inexpensive last minute crunch time work um and i will see you guys on the next one if you haven't already please like share comment and subscribe you guys Thank you guys for your time and watching my videos. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.